Hallelujah. Just walk with me. Yes. Hallelujah. No matter where I go, I want you to walk with me. Yes, sir. Through seen and unseen danger, I want you to walk with me. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God is good. Yes. Say yes. God is good. God is good. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What a blessing to be here. Yes. What a blessing to be here every day. Yes. Every Sunday, what a blessing. God is good. James, God is good all the time. Yes, he is. Uh, you know, it's, God always pre, pre planned things, you know, way in advance. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. That's the kind of God we serve. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. God knows what we don't know. All right. God yeah. can see what we cannot see. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. God is good. Saints. Yes, he is. God is good all the time. All the time. God is good. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Lord is already in the field. The confirmation has already been made. Through this praise and through this song. Yeah. Hallelujah. You know, by being a preacher, you know, you search the Bible. You say, Lord, Lord, which one to preach on? All right. So you go to search in the Bible. You go to search in the Bible. You go to search in the scripture. Lord, where you want me to go in? Yeah. What you want me to feed your people? Yeah. Hallelujah. Then you got to get in the spirit. Oh, you got to yeah. be yeah. fast up. You got to be yeah. praying. Yeah. 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 Lord, where you want me to where you want me to go? <laughs> As I did my research, I was searching, I'm searching, I'm searching. And it all took me back to the old school. Right. Right. To the old testimony. Yeah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. God is good, saints. Yeah. Yes, he is. God is good. Yeah. Hallelujah. Then we get in the building. That's confirmation. Yeah. Up, yeah. The yeah. Up the word. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. That's confirmation. Yeah. Hallelujah. God is good, saints. Yes, he is. God is good. All you got to do is present yourself unto yeah. Him. Just be faithful unto yeah. Him. Yeah. Just give your whole, whole self unto Him. Yeah. And He will lead you and He will direct you. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. All you got to do is be faithful. Yeah. Just be tuned in with Him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Yeah. Glory be to God. God is good, saints. God yeah. is good all the time. Oh, give God. obedience to Almighty God, second to our you know, counsel, yeah. to the first lady, to everyone yeah. that's a sibling David. day. Thank God for uh, thank God that she, thank God for my wife in the building Amen. today, my Amen. daughter. Amen. Give her my hand. Thank God. What <laughs> one, one thing about me, you know, God, God is still saints. Yeah. Although you know, it, it doesn't matter what church you attend, long as you in the Word of God. Yes, right. Amen. Long as you in the Word of God. Long as they teach a sound doctrine. Right. Glory be to God. It doesn't matter. Lord. Uh, it does not matter. Yeah. Hallelujah. So I just thank God for, him for being here today. God is good, saints. Yeah. God is good all the time. God is good. Yeah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. We're going to come from the first Samuel, the 11th chapter. First Samuel. Read at the chapter. Pray, Sam. The devil chapter, beginning at verse 1. Pray, Sam. The devil chapter, beginning at verse 1. In the read, then they has. The Ammonite came up and encamped against Jabez Gilead. And all the men of Jabez said unto Nahash, Make a covenant with us, and we will serve thee. And Nahash the Ammonite answered them, On this condition will I make a covenant with you, that I may thrust out all your right eyes and lay it for reproach upon Israel. And the elders of Jabez said unto him, Give us seven days respite, that we may send messengers unto all the coasts of Israel. And then, if there be no man to save us, we will come out to thee. Then came the messengers to Gibeah of Saul, and told the tidings, tidings in the ears of the people. And all the people lift up their voice and wept. And behold, Saul came after, after the herd out the field. And Saul said, What alien the people that they weep? 
and they told him the tidings of the man of Jabez. And the Spirit of the Lord came upon Saul when he heard those tidings. And his anger was kindled greatly. And he took a yoke of oxen and used them in pieces and sent them throughout all the coasts of Israel by the hands of the messengers, saying, Whosoever come and not forth after Saul and after Samuel, so should it be done unto his oxen. And the fear of the Lord fell upon the people, and they came out with one consent. And when he numbered them in Bezak, the children of Israel were 300,000, and the men of Judah was 30,000. And they said unto the messengers that came, Thus should you say unto the man of Jabesh Gilead, Tomorrow, by that time, the sun be hot, ye shall have help. And the messenger came and showed it to the men of Jabesh, and they were glad. Hallelujah. Therefore the men of Jabesh said, Tomorrow we will come out unto thee, and ye shall do us all that seem it good unto you. And it was so on tomorrow that Saul put the people in three companies, and they came into the midst of the hosts in the morning watch, and they slew the Ammonites until the heat of the, the, heat of the day. And it came to pass that they which remained were scattered, so that two of them were not left alone. Right. One of the six reading right there, we'll use our subjects today is, hold on, help is on the way. Amen. Hold on, help is on the way. Hallelujah, hold on saints, <laughs> hold on, hold on, help is on the way. All we got to do is just hold on. Yeah. Just hold on. Yeah. God is good, saints. God is good all the time. God is good. Hallelujah. God is good. I'm a living witness. Hallelujah. God is good. Glory be to God. I'm a living testimony. I could have been dead in my grave, but God kept me. Watch over me, protect me, lead me, guide me. Hallelujah. Down through the years. Hallelujah. God is good, saints. God is good. I just thank God. I just thank God for praying family. Praying parents. Mother and father. God is good, saints. God is good. Hallelujah. After I reflect back at my life during my teen years, you know, when I was a teenager, one of my grandsons, you know, I was sitting down, he was looking at me. He said, Papa, you got a lot of gray hair. <laughs> I, I said, thank God, God is good. Yeah. Hallelujah. I got a lot of you, I got a lot of great help, but you don't know what I've been through. <laughs> you don't know what I've been through. But I just thank God for this keeping power. Yeah. Glory be to God. I can tell you, any one of these young people, you know, if you if you need to talk to somebody, grab one of these old gray head fellows to your church. Yeah. Hallelujah. Grab one of us. And we can tell you our story. We can tell you our testimony. Yeah. We can tell you what we've been through. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. We was young too. Hallelujah. I remember I was young and wild. <laughs> I'm talking about I had four brothers. Hallelujah. And uh, we used to always like going out. So on the Saturday, you see us in the club. We used to see us in the club on the set. Hallelujah. But but I thank God for for for, for Paul and for love. Hallelujah. We go out there on the Saturday, we be out there on the Saturday in the club. Hallelujah. We come home on a Saturday night. Glory be to God. We tired. We, we ain't out both ends. <laughs> we just sleeping. We had a hard night. All of a sudden, it's time to get up to go to church. It's time to get up to go to church. Oh, Lord, what this man talking about going to church? <laughs> so what I'm saying. We was young. We've been through that. We done did that. We done done that. Glory be to God. Old man, wake us up. We get dressed. I was at, I was belonged to the Church of God in Christ at the time. Y'all know what the Church of God in Christ consists of, then? Yeah. Holiness and sanctified. Yeah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. They believe in pure doctrine. Glory be to God. We go to church. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We go to church. At that every team repeatedly, every Saturday, every Saturday. Oh, well. The old man kind of gets up. It's time to go to church. 
Now we how about we gone in church? Well, we, we, you know, we young and foolish. Hallelujah. But see, the Lord was dealing with us. The Lord was putting his word in us. The Lord was building us up. Hallelujah. He was preparing us. So when we get older, hallelujah, we know how to handle life. We know how to handle life's journey. Glory be to God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory be to God. Then we had a praying mothers too. Oh, we had a praying mothers too. Thank God for praying mothers. Thank God, Thank God for praying mothers. Yeah. Hallelujah. Thank God for praying mothers. Glory be to God. Yeah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And as I grew older, you know, I got married. <laughs> had what I had five kids. <laughs> five kids. Glory be to God. <laughs> Hallelujah. Got a job. Well, I thank God for, for, for great role models. Well, you know, great older men in my yeah, life. You know, Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. That the Lord, that the Lord used them to lead and direct my heart, my path. Oh, you know, one of those great men I see it all the time, my uncle Moran. Yeah. Hallelujah. I always testified about him. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Great role model. Well, Hallelujah. Matter of fact, he got me all on the job where I retired from. Glory be to God. I, I got I got such a story to tell you about that. You see, God always had this plan out. Me and another preacher was talking a couple months ago. He stopped at my house. He said, Preacher, let me tell you something. I, I, I wasn't even aware of this. Here. He said, Oh, you see, the company that you retired uh, at High Drill, he said, Guess what? Which uh, my uncle is his uncle too. My uncle probably the first time he did it, it himself. He said, uh, I was looking for a job too at the time. He said, I had, uh, I went to uh, my uncle, which is his uncle too, and I said, Uncle, I need a job. He said, Well, you know, my nephew is uh, looking for a job too. <laughs> and uh, so I wound up getting a job. And he said, You know, bro, he said, Lord have everything in his plan. Lord. He said, I didn't get that job, but the Lord blessed me. Hallelujah. He went to school. First of all, he became a he a man sister. He a man sister too. He a preacher too. There you go. I don't call his name because you know I don't, oh man, ain't it? <laughs> but he a, he a preacher too. He a, he a preacher of good hope. We both became preachers. See how God had things in the plan? Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. We both were seeking the same job, but just, the Lord led us different directions. Well, yeah. So uh, I wanna get the job. And he wound up uh, getting another job at Avondale. He wound up being an a engineer at Avondale. Well, Hallelujah. And I wound up staying at Hyatt Drill 30, 35 years and wound up retiring. But uh, he wound up being an engineer. Mm -hmm. And uh, he said, you know, God is good. We're both preachers. We both had great jobs. No, tell them what is all the lead you in this lifetime. Amen. Amen. All y'all do is just hold on. Oh. Just keep the faith. Yeah. Just keep trusting in God. Oh. No matter what you may be going through. Glory be to God. Now I work in the petroleum field. Everybody know who works in the petroleum field know how that is. Up and down. When the oil is booming, the job is booming. Oh. When, when things is bad, hallelujah. They may lay you off. Well. I was laid off three times. But guess what? God kept me. God made a way out of nowhere. Hallelujah. God kept me. God provided for me. Hallelujah. During my times of layoff, hallelujah. One year was one year. I was laid off two years. I was laid off three years. But you know, the Lord sustained me. The Lord kept me. Never had a hungry day. Bills was paid. Glory be to God. I was able to raise five kids. Glory be to God. They doing good. Amen. God is good. Amen. God is good, saints. God is good. God is good, saints. God is good. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I just seen some hard times. Hallelujah. I done went through some trials and tribulations. But God is good. God is good. Glory be to God. God brought me out. Hallelujah. Actually, one of these great hey, men. How good God is. He's good. He's good. Yeah. He's good. Better yeah. than good. Yeah. He's good. Yeah. God is good. Yeah. Hallelujah. So I just thank God for being in the day. Hallelujah. Like I said, we, we you know, straight away and so forth. Hallelujah. Then one, one day uh, I heard about good hope. 
how I heard about this printing the word down there, back of Jonestown, now I live in Marrero, so you know I have to travel a couple miles. Uh, you know, they're preaching the word back in Good Hope, they're teaching the word back in Good Hope. So that you know, I'm young, you know, I said, oh well, that may be no one thing. So I was invited to Good Hope, my sister and all was coming back here. So I was invited to Good Hope, I said, well, let me be no one thing, let me make a visit. Oh, but when I hit them doors, boy, the word was going out. Hallelujah. I heard a preacher say, I don't want your money, I want your soul. But I never heard a preacher say that before. He don't want no money, he wants your soul. Boy, I'm talking about some sound doctrine. Hallelujah. And, and, and the man of God was pouring out the word. Hallelujah. He was teaching the word. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He was teaching the word. Hallelujah. Something got a hold to me. Something got a hold to me. Hallelujah. When I walked back out them doors, I wasn't the same anymore. You know that old song right and say something got into my feet. Something got into my hands. And it got all over me. Hallelujah. I wasn't the same. Hallelujah. I had to come back and see what he said again. I had to be curious again. See if I heard what he said. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. All of a sudden I came up, I gave my life unto the Lord. Hallelujah. I repented of my sins. Yeah. The Lord changed my heart. Hallelujah. I went down until I licked it great. Come to find out, me and my wife got baptized the same time. <laughs> me and my wife received the Lord as our personal Savior at the same time. Praise and we got baptized the same time. Amen. Thank God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Yeah. Hallelujah. That's sound doctrine. That's sound teaching. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. We get you still getting to today. Yeah. Our pastor yeah. still preaching yeah. sound doctrine. Yeah. Sound teaching. We're still getting it. Hallelujah for the luck to us. What we gonna do with it? Yeah. What we gonna do with it? Yeah. What we gonna do with it? Hallelujah. We're gonna have trials and tribulations. Yeah. Hallelujah. We're gonna have some hard times. We're gonna have some rough times. Yeah. God, hallelujah. We need Savior. We need change. We need sanctify. We need turn you around. Yeah. Hallelujah. He didn't promise it was gonna be easy. Yeah. He didn't promise this journey was gonna be easy. Yeah. He said you're gonna have trials. You're gonna have tribulation. Yeah. As long as you keep your hands in my hands, yeah. I'm going to keep you. As yeah. long as you keep looking toward the hills and yeah. coming to your help, I'm going to keep you. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hold on. Help is on the way. Yeah. Hold on. Right. Help is on the way. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The book of Samuel speaks of one by the name of Saul. Hallelujah. We know Saul's history. But you know, Saul was a started out good. Well, yeah. He started out good. Yeah. Hallelujah, he started out good. Yeah. Yes. Hallelujah, you find that Saul, hallelujah, he was looking for his uh, his father's long, lost donkeys or asses, whatever you want to call it. He was looking for him. He was looking for him. Hallelujah, you see when Israel went up to the Lord, hallelujah, you see Israel was looking at all the nations that was surrounding them. Well, hallelujah, all the nations that were surrounding them. Now the Lord already had judges. He already had priests. He already had somebody that was going to lead him and guide him. But they want to be like the rest of the nations. Well, they want to be like everybody else. Yeah. Hallelujah. We want a king. We want a king. Yeah. So, Lord, sound like you want a king. Hallelujah. But that was one by the name of Saul. Yeah. Hallelujah. God had to chose him, had to anointed him. Well. Hallelujah. So, Saul was out looking for his uh, father's lost donkeys. <laughs> hallelujah. The prophet Samuel, hallelujah, met him. Well, Why are you looking for his father's lost donkey? Mm -hmm. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Now Saul didn't know what was going on. How he just minded his own business. Yes. Hallelujah. But Samuel walked up to Saul and he said, Hallelujah, you have been chosen. Hallelujah, be king of Israel. Oh, you are the chosen ones. You are the chosen vessel. How you have been chosen by God. Yeah. And God, God told him to anoint you. Yeah. Hallelujah to ordain you. And so you can lead his people. Yeah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. When we find that Saul was a weak and humble fellow. Glory be to God. He was a big headed fellow. Well, hallelujah. He had been a learning king. Saul had, been, Saul had been given power. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. But Saul was humble. He was weak. Hallelujah. It's, they said when they came looking for Saul, Saul was among some stuff. He was hiding himself. Hallelujah, hallelujah. I don't believe you. Hallelujah. Me, a king. Well, so it says Saul was up, hid himself among some stuff. Hallelujah. So when Samuel came and Samuel anointed Saul, hallelujah. Saul, he presented Saul before the people. Hallelujah. This is your new king. Well, this is Saul. 
And you know, a lot of, a lot of people had doubts. How can he lead us? Well. How can Saul lead us? Hallelujah, you know, he's not a great leader. He don't even have a woman. How, how can he lead us? Oh. He don't know nothing about leading lead us. Hallelujah. How can he lead us? Well. So a lot of people had doubt. Yeah. They had doubt about Saul. But God had to anoint him. Yeah. God had to pull out his spirit among yeah. Saul. Yeah. Hallelujah. So Saul, hallelujah. He had a few bands and he went back home to give him. Hallelujah. He went back home. Now you're talking about the king went back home. Hallelujah. He didn't even act like a king. Well, he went back home. Hallelujah. So the Bible said that he went back into the field. He began to plow this land. Yeah. He went back home working. Hallelujah. 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 But those doubters, those hallelujah, hallelujah, that didn't believe that Saul, that the Lord anointed Saul, those doubters, well, hallelujah, in uh, the first Samuel 11 chapter, speak of Nahaz. Nahaz was one of those doubters. Hallelujah. He said, I got more pool than Saul. Mm -hmm. I got more power than Saul. Lord. Hallelujah. He can't lead nobody. He can't even lead his own self. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. So Nahaz was one of those ones that wanted to take reign, yeah. that wanted to be king. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That wanted to be king. So the Bible is saying in this 11th chapter of uh, 1 Samuel that Nahaz surrounded this little town called Jabez Gilead. He surrounded this little city. Hallelujah. I'm going to show him who I am. I'm going to show him how much power I got. And so he took his home, his great omen. So he thought he had. He took his great omen. And he surrounded this little town called Jabesh Gilead. Oh, Hallelujah. In the name of Jabesh, when it seems Saul came against him, hallelujah. They look around and say, hallelujah. We can't fight Nahat. Hallelujah. We don't even have the manpower. Well, we don't even have the military. We don't even have the equipment. We can't fight Nahat. So it's best for us to just surrender. Well, surrender. Mm -hmm. Surrender. Surrender. Let me tell you, saints of God, never surrender without a fight. Yeah. You got to go down fighting. Yeah. You got to go down swinging. Well, Hallelujah. If I'm going to lose a battle, I'm going down fighting. Well, Hallelujah. I'm going to lose the war. I'm going down fighting. Yes. Hallelujah. It's not going to be easy for you to take it. Take over this. It's not going to be over for you to take over this. Hallelujah. You got a fight on your hand. Hallelujah. What that song said, this means war. Hallelujah. This means war. You got a fight on your hand. Hallelujah. So they decided to surrender without a fight. Hallelujah. They decided to throw in a towel. Say, Nahash, we can't fight you. Hallelujah. We can't fight you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But you know, Nahash said, all right, you can't fight. Hallelujah. Well, hallelujah. You can surrender that if you want. But you know that's some consequences. Yeah. Hallelujah. You can't just surrender like that. Well. Hallelujah. What I want you to do, I want you to line up and let me talk out your right eye. Mm -hmm. I want to make a reproach. Hallelujah. I want everybody to know, hallelujah, that I am in control. Well. I am I'm in charge. Hallelujah. Line up and let me talk out your right eye. Yeah. Hallelujah. They went to thank it. They went to thank it. The man uh, uh, uh J.P.S. Gilly, they went to thank it. They said, what? Plucking out my right eye. <laughs> Pluck out my right eye. They went to thank it. You see, they had wanted to make a reproach on him. He wanted to make an example. You see, there was, there was three annual meeting with the Lord. And uh, the man of Jerusalem had to appear before God three times a year. Hallelujah. 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 Just think about it, the eye would have been plucked up. And when they see these men of J.P.S. Gilly, you remember them? They put J.P.S. Gilly. They had to out their right eye. Yeah. <laughs> Hallelujah, a reproach, yeah. an example. Yeah. Hallelujah, but these men are just that killing. Look at their heads and say, look, give us seven days. Seven days. Give us seven days. Let us consult our brethren. Well. See if there's anyone that's going to come help us. Yeah. See if there's anybody that's going to come join us. Let us consult our brother. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. They had to say, go right on, consult them. Go right on, discuss it. Yeah. You see, Nahaz wanted to spread the word anyway. Yeah. Nahaz wanted everybody to know that, hallelujah, he is the king. Well. And how much power that he has. How's yeah. going on to spread the word? Hallelujah. Give us seven days. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. So they went back, they went back to Gibeah. Well. That's where Saul was. Saul was in the field. So when they got back to Gibeah, they, they, they told the tyrants, 
how to draw the people of uh, give, uh, giving him. They, they told their story. Hallelujah. How they had surrounded their little him. And that they had wanted to pluck out their right eye. Well. Hallelujah. So they began to weep. They began to cry. Hallelujah. They began to weep. They began to cry. Well. Telling their story. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What about your story? Oh, you going to continue on weeping. Oh, you going to continue on crying. Hallelujah. Oh, you going to do something about it. Right. Hallelujah. So they continue on weeping. They continue on crying. Well. Hallelujah. That new elected king saw. Hallelujah. Saw. Hallelujah, the tribe of Benjamin. Saul, the tribe of Benjamin. Saul came out of the field. Hallelujah. When Saul came out of the field, he went to town. He went to Gibeah. And he seen all this weeping, all this crying. And Saul said, what's going on here? What's the matter? Why are you weeping? Why are you crying? What's going on here? And they told Saul, Saul, they weeping story. Well, Saul. Have a seat. Let me tell you. You see, they had surrounding Jabesh Gilead. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And he said, the only way he would let us go if we let him pluck our right high. Yeah. Hallelujah. When Saul heard those silent, the Bible said, Saul got angry. The Spirit of the Lord came upon Saul. And Saul got mad. He got angry. He got angry. He got angry. You see, Saul was going to take this line down. How do you say, I've been anointed. How did the Lord put me in a position? And what's for me, it's for me. Yeah. And the devil can't yeah. take it away. Yeah. But what's for me, it's for me. Yeah. God anointed me. God put me in this position. How did the Bible say that Saul got angry? How did, you know that song always say, hallelujah. When the Spirit of the Lord come upon us, we get glad. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Well, let me tell you something. Sometimes the devil make you mad, eh? Yeah. Sometimes you got to get angry, eh? Yeah. Sometimes you got to get mad, eh? Sometimes you got to say, devil, hallelujah, hallelujah. Devil, you can't have my family. No. Devil, you can't have my family. No. Devil, you can't have my peace. No. Devil, you can't have my joy. Yeah. The Lord gave it to me. The world cannot take it away. Yeah. How sometimes it's good to get angry. Yeah. It's good to get mad. Yeah. It's good to get mad at the devil. Yeah. How as we look around the things that has gone on in the world today, we need to get mad. Yes, we need to get angry. Yes, Hallelujah. So Saul got mad. Yes. Saul got angry. Yes. So Saul took a yoke of oxen and he began to use it in pieces. He began to cut it up. He began to cut it up. Well. He, he cut it up. And he spread it all out through the, through, through the region of Israel. Well. Hallelujah. He spread that yoke of oxen. Hallelujah. He told the people, Hallelujah. This is going to happen to your yoke of oxen. Well, right. If you do come out and fight against, if you now come out and fight with Saul and Samuel, the damn, same thing is going to happen to your yoke of oxen. Well, right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So Saul met business. Saul met business. Saul met business. Yeah. I'm going to show you who King is. Well, right. I'm going to show you who God chose. Yeah. Hallelujah. God, Saul met business. Well, right. Hallelujah. Saul met business. Yeah. Hallelujah. Saul met business. Hallelujah. He said, yeah, you go tell the man of, of J.D.S. Gillen. Hallelujah. Go tell him, don't they worry about what they had said. Don't they worry about what they had said. Well, Hallelujah. Tomorrow, yeah. before the sun get hot, well, you still have help. Yeah. Hallelujah. All you have to do is just hold on. Oh. Tell tomorrow, yeah. you still have hope. Yes, oh. You yeah. still have help. Yeah. All you have to do is just hold on. Oh. Hallelujah. 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 They took the tidings back to the man of Jabesh Gilead. How they took the tidings back, what Saul told him. They took the tidings back and they told the man of Jabesh Gilead. Yeah. He said, Don't you worry. Hallelujah. Tomorrow we're going to have help. Yeah. Hallelujah. The scriptures say, Hallelujah. When Saul did that, 300,000 Israel soldiers showed up. 30,000 men of Judah showed up. Yeah. Help is on the way. Yeah. Help is on the way. Yeah. All you have to do is just hold on. Oh. Help is on the way. Yeah. Help is on the way. Help is on the way. Yeah. All you have to do is just hold on. Oh. Help is on the way. Yeah. Help is on the way. So they took the tithes back to the man of Jabesh Gilly. And they told him what Saul said. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. These men got the energy back. Yeah. They were glad. They were happy. Yeah. They were excited. Yeah. Hallelujah. They were so excited. They went on and told Nahash. He said, he said, look, 
tomorrow is coming. Well, do what you gotta do. Well, and we're gonna do what we gotta do. Yeah. We ready. Hallelujah. Their spirit was encouraged. Well, Their soul was encouraged. Yeah. Hallelujah. It was ready for the battle. Uh -huh. Hallelujah. 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 Don't let the devil destroy you. No. Don't let the devil beat you down. No. Hallelujah. Help is on the way. Oh, yeah. All you gotta do is just hold on. Oh, yeah. Help is on the way. 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 Yeah. The songwriter is saying, well, we get his on it for a night. But joy is coming in the morning. The only thing I do is just hold on. Wait till tomorrow. Wait till in the morning. If I just hold on, victory is coming. Deliverance is coming. All I do is just hold on. Help is on the way. Help is on the way. Just hold on. Help is on the way. Just hold on, saints. Don't give up. Just hold on. Help is on the way. It looked bad. Hallelujah. It looked bad. It looked terrible sometimes. It looked ugly sometimes. Hallelujah. All you gotta do is just hold on. Help is on the way. Help is on the way. Help is on the way. All we gotta do is just hold on. Help is on the way. So when the word got back to the men of JBS Gillian, they were glad. They were glad. So Saul lined his people up three to company. And they slew, they had to now admit uh, Ammonites. Mm. They slew them, they destroyed them, they wiped them out. Yeah. Hallelujah, the victory. The victory, the victory is in the Lord. Yeah. The victory is in the Lord. Yes, All you gotta do is trust in God. Hallelujah. All you gotta do is take the Lord to the battle with yes, you. Yes. Always remember God. No oh. matter what Satan is say to you or do to you, just remember God is in control. Yeah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. The songwriters say it may not come when, you, when we want it. Yeah, but always. He's always on time. He's on time, God. He's on time, God. He's on time, God. Hallelujah. That's Shaq and me, Shaq and Abednego. They went over cast into the fire in front of oh, Hallelujah, hallelujah. They refused to fall down. Yes. Hallelujah. The king said, you know we got cast into the fire in front of They said, what the boy say? Hallelujah. I'm going to cast me into the fire in front I know that the God we, we serve is able. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He's able. Yeah. Hallelujah. They didn't stop there. They didn't stop there. When they say, if you don't deliver us, yeah. Hallelujah, we still not gonna bow down. Yeah. We still not gonna bow down. Hallelujah. We still not gonna serve your God. Because no. we know to serve our God, we serve his able. He's able. He's able. Yeah. He's able. He may not come when you want him. Yeah. But he's on time, God. Yeah. He's on time, God. Yeah. He's on time, God. Hallelujah. Another example is Lazarus. Lazarus, his friend, his dear friend. They were saying that your friend Lazarus is sick. He needed death. And Lazarus wound up dying. Hallelujah, hallelujah. But Jesus still tarried for what? How many days? Four days. He still tarried for four days. Hallelujah. When he got to this, to this hometown where Lazarus was, Martha came running. Ah, yeah. oh, if you would have been here. If you would have been here, yeah. our brother Lazarus would not have died. Yeah. Hallelujah. If you would have been here, hallelujah. But there's still hope. Yeah. There's still hope. Yeah. It is not all lost. Yeah. There is still hope. Yes, Jesus said, take me where you laid it at. Yeah. Take me to the grave. Yeah. Hallelujah. He rolled back the stone. Yeah. Hallelujah. He called. He said, Lazarus. Hallelujah, you're talking about man the day of four days. <laughs> Lazarus. Well. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You had to call Lazarus by his name. Because yeah. if you would have called uh, Isaac, Jacob, and Abraham, all them boys would have came out the grave. Yeah. All of them came out the grave. Well. Hallelujah. So he made, he, made, he made his prayer to call just one person. Yeah. And he said, Lazarus. Well. Lazarus. Yeah. Hallelujah. Lazarus. I guess Lazarus might have been down with the Pelsey in, in a revival sometime. Yeah. He might have been having a revival with Abraham Isaac. Those fellas that died in yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Before time. Yeah. Hallelujah. I can see what Lazarus was having that revival. Lazarus would have to stop and say, Hutch, somebody's calling my name. Oh, oh Hutch. Yeah. Hutch. Yeah. Somebody's calling my name. Oh, must be Jesus. Hallelujah. I said, look, boys, I got to go. Somebody's calling my name. Hallelujah. Lazarus, he began to hop. He still had them grave clothes on, but Lazarus began to hop. 
你好高的贵，好你好高的贵，好你是上周当几个广告，你你这种啊，我很有你呢，很有你呢，好你上的贵，好你上的贵，这很有你呢。Hallelujah! It took four days, but that's a rule from the grave. Yeah. Hallelujah! He made a believe out of me. Oh, yeah. He made a believe out of me. Yeah. He made a believe it out of me. Yeah. Hallelujah! All you got to do is live a saved and sanctified life. Yeah. And if you want to make a believe out of me, uh, just live a saved and sanctified life. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah! I know a friend of mine, every time I see him out there running to some boys that I used to run with, Hallelujah! they told me I was going to a phase. It, it's been 40 years, I'm still going through a phase. <laughs> it's been 40 years, I'm still going through a phase. I'm still holding on. I'm still saved and sanctified. I'm still going through a phase. Oh, this didn't work, saints. This didn't work. Oh, I'm going to live with you. This didn't work. It works. It works. Hallelujah. Y'all done it for a mighty long way. A mighty, mighty long way. All you got to do is just hold on, saints. Just hold on for a little while longer. Help is on the way. May God bless you. Keep that out. I got joy in my soul. God is in control. I got Satan on my trail, but I'm singing God is well. He's attacking every day, but I'm watching while I pray. No matter the attack, I won't turn back.